New Game Order, Meta Publishing, Unity. Hey, here is Joe and welcome to The Uncertain Light at the End. This is the second game of the series. You can already see how they improved by just changing to the Unity engine because they before they used the same engine as Talos Principle. I think that's an old Half-Life engine or, or an old Counter-Strike engine. Very old engine, regardless. And you can already see how it improves, so we shouldn't have those weird red lines uh, that you have to follow but you can't see because they're in the grass. That was really troublesome in the first game. That's the only thing I really remember from the first game. So, uh, story-wise, uh, this is a robot-driven world uh, where the robots are supposed to keep the last humans safe, but actually they are pressing them. And at the end cutscene of the first game, we finally managed to find our first human. And I, s I think we're playing as that human now. And then let's go right in. Midway through the 22nd century, robots developed and maintained by the USS Corporation suddenly turned against humanity. They flooded the water supply with harmful nanites, sending most of the population into a coma-like state. These countless men, women, and children were loaded into transport shuttles and whisked away. No one knows where. No one knows why. More than a year has passed since the incident. Those who managed to evade the robots' clutches scavenge the now silent cities. Mechanized police and drones search relentlessly for any remaining signs of life. Even most domestic bots now report humans on sight. Under USS Corp's watchful eye, a new robotic civilization is emerging from the ashes of the old. In the face of encroaching extinction, the few who remain fight to survive searching for the reason behind humanity's fate and clinging to the hope of better days ahead. Okay, so this will be another one of the subtitles do not match the voiceover games. Okay, they're going for the same art style, just in a better engine. In the last game we were a robot that was part of the like robot uprising against the other robots to protect the humans uh, because we did do custom uh, updates instead of automatic updates on our station and that's why we didn't get the eradicate all humans or round up all humans to be sent somewhere update which made us an evil robot in the eyes of the other robots because we didn't get our automatic updates. All the ones who got the automatic updates, even the household robots, uh, they now are searching for humans. And I think that's the girl we found at the end of the first game, but it's been like three quarters of a year since I played the, the first game. In the second game it came out at a time where I was preoccupied doing something else and it just came out of nowhere with no big pre-announcement and then it was out and I couldn't play it at that time. So I put it off for like half a year later now. I wanted to play it when it came out but I couldn't. There's no time, Em. Saw some cops down the block. Probably the neighborhood patrol. Have you got the list? No, but we know what we need. Vera was up all night. If we don't find something to break the fever, sooner or later someone's gonna hear her crying. That's priority number one. Brian still isn't sleeping. And Alex's leg is making him even crankier than normal. We should find something for them too. Definitely. 
We'll cover more ground if we split up. Let me know what you find. You got it. Approach the active point and choose an action from the pop-up menu by holding down the left mouse button and dragging the pointer. Okay. Well, that's a little inconvenient. This shelf's cutting off access to all the pediatric medicines. We have to find a way to move it without drawing any attention. Climb it. Definitely not moving it on my own. Park, give me a hand over here. Sure thing. Quietly. I expect... The cops will hear it. We need to find another way. Ideas? This thing's way too heavy for us to lift on our own. We might have better luck if we had some kind of lever. Let's take a look. Could be some tools I can use. So it's lever, not lever, telling me that this is a United States and not Britain. Whoa, that's a lot of drugs. I don't know what they're all for, but I gotta find something for Vera's fever. And I'm guessing it's in that case. I hate to admit it, but if Matt were here, he'd figure something out. Again, it doesn't fit perfectly. What are you? Some kind of power unit. Better take it. Could come in handy. In later stages of the, the game, we'll definitely also get uh, like timed sections, but, but I don't think it will be timed section now to start off the game with, because that would be brutal. Still quiet so far, but we have to hurry. So there are always someone who is struggling with the controls Every time and stuff asthma at the beginning. In, I feel so they so can't helpless. do that. An asthma spray, yeah. Just get not one, get like 30 dozen of them from the store behind that door over there. I'll be looking there in a second. Just want to go around the room. He used to work at his father's music store before the incident. I know it's silly, but whenever he's wearing those headphones, I really worry the cops will hear and come running in. Hey, I found this. Thought it might be, you know, useful. Great. I've been scared to check, but I think the one I've been using is on its last legs. Uh, wasn't that... F I'm positive that the meds we need are buried under this shelf, but how am I going to move it? This thing weighs a ton. Maybe. If this thing comes crashing down, you'll hear the noise for blocks. Gotta come up with something. So pediatric medicine, so the person in the fever is a child. That was too close for comfort. Damn it, just my luck. Empty, yes. Okay, so going here. Don't activate the Hello, computer. Hello, Mr. Cash Register. How's retirement treating you? <laughs> what are you? It's some cable. Cables are useful. So let's look at what it is. This one doesn't attach to anything. It has a weird port. This port is very weird. Looks a bit like the power uh, and the power units attachment, but that had five prongs. And then the three prong for. Uh, don't you Americans have like a three prong pronged uh, power cable normally? So what have we got here? We have two prongs on ours. It's the manager's office. Probably something useful inside. Only problem? It's locked. There's no way I'm getting inside without a keycard. I would have just wanted to ask next. Keycard or code? Whoa, look at all those meds. No way I'm breaking down this door, though. I'll have to find a control panel. I hope the humans aren't fighting against each other. Ploy of the month. Thanks, thanks, Dad. I got the joke. 
<laughs> break room? It's a rec room. The door's locked. How to get inside? Rec room could have some coffee, which could be useful. I Toilets? don't think I'll find medical supplies in there. Yeah, but nope, let's waste not our the time, Emily. Oh, let's waste our time there. The back door is already unlocked. Could be useful if we need to cut and run. Oh, we can't. We're not finished here. This isn't just any old supply run. We have to find something for Vera's fever. Yeah, I assume Vera's the shot. Can we? I can't get this open on my own. Maybe the fire alarm? Nope. Bad idea. That would bring a lot of unwanted guests. Yeah. So... Can't I take the picture and hold it in front of some face scan scanner stuff? I try to look everywhere. We always have right click to zoom in and F to press the flashlight. Um, I have no idea what I'm searching for because it will now have placed the keycard somewhere. We can't leave yet. Olga's counting on us to find something for Vera's fever. So Vera is a shirt. I mean... Whoa, that's a lot of drugs. I don't know oh, what they're that. all for, but uh, I gotta find something for Vera's fever. I wanna find the, the and skip key. it's in that case. I hate to admit it, but if Matt were here, he'd figure something out. I'm at a loss. Let's talk to Park. This isn't the time to talk. Okay, so I'm missing one, one very obvious, maybe in the middle of the room on the floor. That's what I'm always forgetting to check. That's under retirement uh, through here. I'm missing something here. That's the control panel, it's broken. We can't open that door. We can't open this door. We can't open that door. She will, nope, will refuse time, to go to the only other room. We can't go outside there to search. Okay. The end. That, ladies and gentlemen, was uh, the uncertain light at the end. What the fuck game? Am I missing something very obvious? Obviously supposed to be obvious because it's the first level and we're supposed to learn about how the game works here I can't open the door not when it's blocked like this um out of unwanted guests. Oh. Playing the the end of the voice line and then nothing, okay? We directly see that the game is bugging. Um That's it. We're out of options. Um Great! This is the first part of the adventure game of the series of the... Maybe maybe this. No, this is about the freaking... This is the pharmacy manager's keycard. Oh, God! They definitely pointed at the fucking thing. And just looking at the side where I wanna wanna put the lever, let's go to the rec room first. Please contact the administrator. Yeah, right. They're long gone. So that one has has a comp uh, has a failure. And this one for some reason doesn't. Nice one. Okay. Room. It's a battery. Uh, oh, Something that's a battery. tells me this could come in handy. Why is the, the battery uh, having its light on? 
that makes it go out. Or maybe that's just fluorescent. Just to, to screw with you thinking that it's on. Marta would love this. She's crazy about anime and pretty much anything else from Japan. That's nice. Pick it up! <laughs> we have... We have not put nothing in our uh, thing yet. Right. No power. And why? This terminal screen. It's weird it's not attached to the rest of the hardware. Out of order, of course. Sleeping piss. What kind of fossil is this? These terminals belong in a museum. Um, I see something on that shelf that I really want. What's left of humanity is a little bit like this poor little guy. No one left to water it. Oh, the irony. Brian's insomnia doesn't seem to be getting any better. Maybe these pills will do the trick. As with always uh, any of these games, I'm always trying to do every option. So what's this? I don't know what this is, but let's first plug the cable. That's the the uh, power cable that we... Uh, no, that's the other cable. And then this. It's alive. Nice work, Emily. Remember, breathe in, breathe out. Can I... I can't zoom in at that again. Okay, activate it. Welcome, Jesse Maiden. Uh, gallery. A cat. Who doesn't love his cat pictures? Pause. No cause. Email. Security update. Dear customer, due to the release of, of an important security update, H12556, make sure that your home robot will be connected to the dock and fully charged within the next 24 hours. The update process may take a long time. Do not turn off the power to the dock until the process is complete, otherwise it will damage systems files and even cause your robot to fail. Taking care of your safety is a priority goal of the United Science sector. And that's the security update for the robots that killed the humans. Not killed, but... They round them up after that. Jess, I missed a few boxes again. Don't get me wrong, you're my brother, I trust you completely and I had hate to ask you this, but are you sure Maya, Mia wasn't involved? Only she and I had access to the drugs. If she started selling drugs to drug addicts, or worse, using them, as a father you must speak to her as soon as possible. I'm not a stranger to her either, and I'm worried too. At this age they can do stupid things and she's a real rebel. I really hope I'm wrong. Call me if you have any news. We might find a tucked away uh, medicine at some point. Bad news, Jesse. What's up? Promise you won't be mad? Uh, what happened? Lisa broke your favorite cup, but she's very sorry. See? Misa. The calendar one? That's on me. I was running late. Forgot to clean up. Sorry. Wait, so I punished her for no reason at all? You've got some explaining to do. She's been sitting in her box all day and won't look me in the eye. She's she's a cat, she'll get over it. Yep, but they'll remember everything. Security system is online, disable it. We still need to find some kind of lever. Oh, break room also. Break room is our thing where we want to go. That's a bit more diplomas than you need. You'd only need like two or three to become an apoth apothecarist and not seven. What's that one? Die große Nordklinge. That's German. And what's under that I can't read. Ah, so comfy. Works. What's that? I remember these. Yeah, Rubik's Cube. Take hey, little it. Buddy, why so quiet? No one to play with? Can I? I can't play it. And I can't pick it up. Grandpa used a wheelchair too. 
He refused to have anything to do with mechanized prosthetics. He said all this newfangled technology couldn't be trusted. <laughs> he hit that nail on the head. Yeah, but normally, like the the looks like someone forgot to lock up electric legs. They just do what they're told to. That they don't have an AI in them that can go rogue. Another battery. We got two. What are A you? Safe. Now, how to go about getting it open? Uh. Maybe Brian could hack the safe, but I'm not getting it open without a key. You need to find a key. Pictures of the family here. Yeah, there are two brothers and the one brother's daughter. There's a lot of things I miss from before, but the idiot box isn't one of them. Idiot box is great. Oh, sake now. Turn it off. Uh, that's not the one I'm pointing at, this one. Finding this drugstore was a godsend. Luckily, it has some more of the meds Justin needs. Although, let's be honest. A wheelchair is already pretty much a death sentence in this city. Thankfully, this place is the perfect place to hole up. Might even stay a while. Food could become a problem, since the closest store is three blocks away, but Justin's safety has to come first. I've been going from time to time to scout out the area, praying they don't spot me. Turns out the commotion I heard yesterday was a group of people trying to hide here. Nothing but former survivors now. You know what? Everything worked out. They made a bunch of racket in the sales area, but I just shut the door and they never even knew we were here. Okay. Um, at this point, why is that Russian down there? Um, at this point, I'm pretty certain I know why the robots uh, started rounding up the humans. They became, uh, they had this collective brain disease that they often have in uh, video games. Like the brain disease where they start littering uh, the entire world with useless audio logs that you would never do. And that's a pretty good reason to, to uh, just kill them off. Because at that point humanity is just uh, not useful anymore for the robots when they start littering everything with their stupid, stupid audio logs. Meh. I want to go to the toilet. So, what have we got here? Ah, now I can see it? I didn't get the interaction point before, a that's a screwdriver. Toothbrush. It's so tiny and cute. Okay. Good that I said that before. Okay, that's great. Why don't you take it? You have a kid to take care of. And also you undo your fl flashlight. They had a robot, which we already knew. This is unlocked, it said, yeah. We can go in there in a second. Now let's scour these. What is here? Androgen esters, androgens, anabolic stuff. Uh, I don't think we need stuff like that. But let's still look, what are you? <laughs> Finders keepers? But you don't keep it. Why would you? I mean, it's it's actually useless. There's one, in, but the Rubik's cube, for example, is bingo. These will come in handy for sure. Yeah, just take them. Oh, yeah, it's own, isn't it isn't open yet. Whoa, that thing's massive. If only it was full of food. Surprise, out of order. Have to restore. It's a magnetic key for a safe, but which one? No I good. Know which safe. Out of reach. I know which one. There's only one safe. This is where you can turn on the lights again, and that also those. That's part of this uh, storm storage place. Just want to go around these to find uh, any more other stuff because we might alert the robots by turning on the power. This thing's been lying here for a long time. That's the employee of the month. Can't it say it's a thing. It's the employee of the month. And 
one more. We might need this ladder later. Okay. And over here. The painkillers aren't our uh, number one priority. Um, take that and that and that and that and that. We need all of that. Please. Take battery number three. Oh, yeah, I already saw where the three batteries go. There's something pleasant about the rustling of paper and the smell of faded ink. Top car. Autonomous aero cars. Are they safe? The obsolete vehicle trade and initiative launched last year's joint effort between the state and the leading aero car manufacturers has proven extraordinarily effective at liberating our streets from the risk and pollution inherent in ground-based vehicles and combustion en engines. The results haven't been entirely surprising considering the generosity of both consumer and corporate incentive incentives. Up to 70% of a new aero car's cost can be covered by certain models of Triton. The air pollution and public safety issues associated with ground transportation have steeply declined. Nationwide da data indicates that only 25% of the population still owns these vehicular dinosaurs, primarily rural residents and farmers. At the current pace, it won't be long before every family has an aero car of its own. It's also noteworthy that more than half of current aero cars also employ the latest in safe driving technology, potentially indicating the dawn of a new era where manual driving is a thing of the past. I like manual driving. This aero car looks like it's been sitting here for a while. Probably That's since a the incident. I'd better I check thought for it was a cargo useful. container. This looks like a cargo container, not like a car. Like from behind, but okay, let's open it. Damn it, it's locked. But I'm guessing the key can't be too far away. Maybe inside the drugstore. It's been out for half a year. Bugs like that should be gone. Oh, we are doing one of those other games where shift is walk slow. The upper one, please, first. Those batteries I found will fit here. Yeah. Sticking my hand in there is asking for trouble. Place all three of them. Not one by one, please. Yeah, that's the emergency. Uh, I mean, why do you have a terminal like this for emergency power? Why? You wouldn't go on battery power all the time. With the power restored, maybe I can bring this beast back to life. This thing, by the way, isn't my favorite. Like this weird to choose from. Fingers crossed. We have to click and hold the thing. Power failure. Restarting the alarm system. No, Disable no, guard no, to make no, doors no. release. Park? Park? Okay, this is not good. Park? Where are you? What the? The alarm. Disable it using the manager's computer. Damn. On the way. Quick! Just wait. Hurry, Park! Quick time events. Great. What the hell is he? This is getting bad. Again. No.
Oh god, no. Is that really where you placed your fucking... Checkpoint. Park? Where are you? What the? the Give me Disable a fast forward thing computer. for a message Damn. I've seen before. Way. Quick. Okay, they didn't learn anything by the failures. The few failures that the first game had. Just wait. Hurry, Park. Was Q the last time? Is it randomized? No. At least you can muscle memory your way through this. What the hell is he? This is getting bad. Hey! I need to wait for the other camera to pass by. Uh, place your checkpoints where they make sense and don't have me listen to the same talky talky bullshit 20 dozen times. Park? Where are you? <coughs> what the? The alarm. Disable it using the manager's computer. Damn. On the way. Quick. I assume he has to solve the harder puzzle. We need to immediately just, just wait. run left. Hurry, Park. What the hell is he? This is getting bad. Yeah. Okay, we can't do anything. We can't go left, and we can't stay. Park? Where are you? What the? The alarm. Disable <sighs> it using the manager's computer. Damn. I'm not Quick. a friend of watching cutscenes 17 times. Just make the cutscene skippable. It's not that hard. Q. Hurry, Park. Q, 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 Q. What the hell is he? This is getting bad. I had no time to react the last time. Again. Left again. It was close. Okay, this sucks. Or oh, we need to go to the other side. Okay. We were You're missing right one click of the left button. Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I just need a sec. You sure the alarm will stay off? I guess. Anyway, it's off now. Just shout if you need me. Stupid fridge. I should try again. With the power restored, maybe I can bring this beast Don't tell back me the same life. thing thing twice. It did s do why didn't it Suddenly work? Suddenly I've got chills running down my spine. Yes, it worked. Okay. So we want Can I one down? Oh god, be faster. Oh, it's the exact opposite of what I thought. How it worked. Taking those. I just hope Alex knows how to say thank you. Do we have other things on the other? Uh, let's just, let's just do the fuck you. The whole turn around. Now we have to walk all the way up to it, making the cutscene slower. On reshake, it's it just those not Okay, I can see the interaction points, so it's not there's not a hidden thing for turning this around twenty times. And I'm in a position when when we did this, I'm in a position where I can't do it again. Although they knew that you'd have to press it multiple times, so you have to watch it. This is just bad game design. Why can't I now say, make it go down a few more times? But no. 
I have to slowly watch this, watch her uh, readjust herself. And when she has readjusted herself, she is not in reach of the thing. Now she is, of course. You need that thing. Grab that. Take the mask. You need it for Corona. So... Just over here. Is he here now? No. Okay. Uh, ah, safe was in the other room. Sorry. This room. Safe. Dead. Skip? No, no. Move the pieces so that the sum of all numbers around each triangle equals the number inside the triangles. Okay. Um, we need a... S okay. Okay, we have to, to change them like this. Uh, we want a 7 here, so this is the... One of the lowest way to reach the 7. Which means this is a 6, so this needs a 4. Which means this is a 7, so this needs a 6. Okay. So we need to try with 2 and 4. Which this means this needs a 4, 2. And this is a 6, so now it needs a 7. Oh, we don't have a 7. Oh, I wanted to do these differently. Yeah, okay. So, this is a 9, this needs a 4. This is a 8, this needs a 3. This is 6, this needs also 3. So these ones round. So we have a 9, this needs a 4. Not, not there. Um, how do I make those fit? So these... Oh god. I just want to work my way in one, one direction, but this doesn't always work. So let's let's get this out of here. Oh, uh, we have here nine. So these two can change. These two can change. Uh, the problem is this is eight. We need a three here. Um, what are, what am I missing here? Let's try these, this again, this way around. <sighs> I am, will not skip it. Nine and three is perfect. Nine and three doesn't work. So do we have other ways? make it work like this then we can change these two up so this is a thick six this needs a three so this is an eight it needs a two this is a five it needs a three perfect i will not skip puzzles I don't know where the checkpoints are, and I've not, I've yet to see this check autosave symbol, arrow car key, key for. And then we open the car, and then the car we have a big lever to uh, write in the thing, I hope. Now, let's see what we've got. A gravity jack. Just what we need to move that shelf out of the way. Okay, that's a gravity jack. How would that work? Okay, that's... Okay, yeah. Works like those things where you have those bins and you step on it to open it. <laughs> Just like that. Okay. Hey, I found a gravity jack in the garage. 
Bet we could use it to move that shelf. That could work. Prepare for quick time events. Slide it underneath, and I'll grab it from the other side. All right. Um, it was too. No, no, damn it! Come on, Em, grab the stuff and let's get out of here. Anti fever. It's here. Let's go. Shit, my backpack. Hold on, I'll be right back. Park, no, forget about it. My inhalers. Park? Huh? Park? Emily! Human, stop where you are. For your safety, remain calm and do not resist. I assume that will just change a few voice voice lines. But maybe he would have died otherwise. And this is the place where we live in. If they got electricity still running, they are easy where to the hell track. Where you disappear to? Oh, you're back. So, how did it go? Things got hairy. I'll explain later, but it worked out. We got the meds. Anne's just trying to play it cool. You should have seen her blast that cop with a flare gun. She... what now? Enough, Alex. Just stop. We checked and no one came after us, okay? Goddamn stupid kids. You better learn to take things more seriously. Oh, don't mind him. The important thing is that you're safe and sound. Now then, I just made pancakes. Any takers? Thanks, but I gotta get some sleep. I can barely stand on two legs, much less hold a fork. All right, so I'll heat up a breakfast for you when you wake up. But please, will you first get some fever medicine to Olga? It appears Vera is getting worse. And you, Park? Don't mind if I do. Thanks. Where's Matt? Off getting supplies. We're running low on food. He should be back soon. Emily, I think the old man needs your help. Can you check in with him? Ah, now I found the thing. What's entry edit to what? Entry edit to what? I don't have any button to open any in-game menus. That? No. It's sometimes F1. Okay. Um, this is where we are going to continue to explore in the next episode where we look at what our lair looks like. Have a nice day. See you then. Mm.